Uhuru Kenyatta has congratulated healthcare workers in the country for their effort in mitigating the spread of COVID-19 pandemic in his Tuesday 57th Mashuja Day celebrations in Kisi. The president also called on more youths in the country to exploit technology in solving challenges that the country has grappled with for years. David Mudoka reports. <laughs> As President Uhuru Kenyatta on Tuesday led the nation in marking its 57th Mashuja Day celebrations, the head of state commended efforts by healthcare workers in taming the spread of the coronavirus pandemic since the first case was reported on 13th March. The president paying tribute to various health workers who have unfortunately succumbed to the virus while on the front line in the COVID-19 war for the past seven months. In particular, I want to give special mention to our departed health workers. Their memory will forever be engraved on our hearts. These brave souls paid the ultimate price. And like our founding fathers, they teach us that heroes are ordinary people who are made extraordinary by unusual circumstances. President Kenyatta also heaped praise on youths in the country for innovating digital solutions to problems that the country has grappled with for years. Kenyatta citing three university students, Michael Malombo Moisakenyi and Ken Kioria Gishira from the Jomo Kenyatta University of Agriculture and Technology, as well as Roy Alela from the University of Nairobi, who this year bagged global innovative awards. While the former came up with a robotic wooden machine, the latter has invented smart gloves that auto-translate sign language into speech. But the young people who embrace the positive and the possible will emerge heroes and makers of things. So therefore a good starting point for all our young people is to look for a problem and solve it. And despite political tensions seemingly running high in the country each passing day, the president further called upon Kenyans to remain peaceful, adding that no one is bigger than the country. It is very easy to lose a country. And as your fourth president, I need to remind you that you will have a fifth, a sixth, and even a tenth president but you have only one Kenya. Up to 210 Mashujas were fated on Tuesday for the exemplary efforts in this year's Mashujas edition. President Uhuru Kenyatta today led Kenyans in marking the country's 57th Mashuja Day celebrations with the nostalgic pomp and color that has been missing in all national events throughout the year. David Muthoka, TV 47 at the Gusi Stadium in Kisi County.